I need a drink for this one. Guys, so I can just confirm now that my sweetheart texted me. She said she's back in Joburg. <clears throat> oh. My sweetheart just confirms she's back in Joburg after all we've been through together. Um, I don't know if this is the part we are breaking up or if there's some if there was something agent that I didn't have to know. Uh, so all this time I'm going crazy. My own girlfriend is... Uh, this is difficult. So all this time I'm going crazy saying I can't find Kanye... Uh, She's actually on a flight back to Joburg. She didn't say we didn't fight. Um, we didn't argue like uh, uh, the same day that she left. I thought I'm just honestly sending a message. just to make my woman happy. <laughs> uh, I don't know if this is love, but if it's love, it hurts. <laughs> oh, it hurts. If it's love, it really, really hurts. See, how do I even open this? I don't have energy. I'm shaking, like... Oh, baby, I didn't know we were like this. Everything I've had, I shared with you. You know, I thought I'm bringing you to Dubai so we can be global. I say, babe, South Africa is crowded. Uh, you don't make that much. How about we go somewhere and just try for a year? So I registered a company in Dubai, which is um, Kanye's the fifty-one percent shareholder. She she came up with the name. I was like, Ah, babe, come up with the name. It's called Hair Connect Media. Um, the plan was to for her to do her social media stuff. Uh, whilst I just do my regular work. And it costs more than a hundred and something thousand just to register a company. And I pay for that. Uh, leaving Joburg, even if I was fighting with my friends, first class, it's on me, baby. If you shine, I shine. If you go up, I go up. Your battles are mine too. Your fights are mine too. We didn't fight. We, we didn't fight um, like physically or anything. Um, it was just different, different charts. Uh, but guys, this hurts. And if this is love, hmm. I don't know if this is her saying goodbye to me because when you when you when I drop you at the saloon and you take a flight back to South Africa, um, and I'm I seem to be a crazy person looking for you everywhere because I care. You should have just let me know, baby. I need to go back to SA. I've got some deep shit to take care of, you know, or I've got stuff that's happening. Then I'll be like, okay. I mean. We had spoken about such, but don't, don't, don't do it. That no, man, this is this is this is wrong. And then you blame me for not um, 
uh, uh, for coming on social media because I'm looking for my girl. I knew something was wrong, you know. I knew that I'm looking for my missus. I'm looking for her. Like, something is off about the silence. Ah. Guys, I really need to drink this and, and figure out But anyway, a trip for one is better than than two. I don't want to act strong because I'm... Oh, my word. Like, I, I don't even know how to say. Imagine you take your girlfriend on a first class. You quarantine with her. You're just doing things to make her happy. I mean, you leave her daughter in a very nice place. I paid... I think 42,000 for that. Um, before she leaves SA, I pay another 40,000 just for tuition. How am I supposed to feel? You know, um, how am I supposed to feel? Like, tell me guys, if you are just realizing your girlfriend is in South Africa, like right now, how would that make you feel when you didn't fight with her like uh anything physical or beating each other up or throwing things there was no such it was just like your missus and then you see on her instagram that do you know when i wanted to leave south africa i thought about just disappearing on everyone but i said uh, i'm a soldier i carry my own I carry my own people, you know. I I don't abandon people, you know. I just don't wake up going in thing A. Not because I can't afford to do it. I can afford to do it and just be boom in thing A. Nobody knows where I am. But at least have a little bit of decency. Just say, baby, I need to go back home. There's something that's happening. Not for me to find out by text and then Instagram. Wow, was I really that bad to you? How many things of my own did I sacrifice just to say, baby, whew, I'm hurt, guys. <clears throat> man, we are men, we don't cry, but this one is deep. I just told my brother now that Dude, I video called Kanye right now. She's in South Africa. Like, we've been in Dubai for a bit, you know. Uh, she's now a resident of Dubai, which is, I mean, yo. I should have listened to my mother. But anyway, that's love. I mean, Keep loving someone. Keep loving someone. But it hurts. And I'll say this to the world today, baby. You hurt me. You one person that if I had money, you knew I had. If I didn't, you knew. I never, when I met Kanye, I learned to tell the truth. Baby, I have X amount in my bank account. What are we doing? If I have 5,000, if I have 1 million, if I have 2 million, can you know? If whatever amount I have, I never lied to that woman. I never lied to that woman. I told the truth. And can you is the first lady uh, I never cheated on. Like she's the first person I never cheated on in my whole life. Like I've been a bad guy, guys. Like I'll... <laughs> In this hotel room, whatever, I'll have two, three other rooms full of people that are flying in from anywhere. I never did that to her. But the least I expect is just to be cheated with a little, like, babe, I'm, I'm going to go home. Uh, I'm upset. I'm mad. Um, at least, at least just tell me, my love. At least I am... Like, they just tell me, bro, you and I were dogs. You and I, 
we were like so close to each other. I never tell the lie. I told Kanye everything. Everything, my problems, my fights, my correct doings, my bad doings. I'll just dump it on the, on the table. You know, baby, this is what's happening right now. She probably knows everything about me. Then imagine your person just says, Hi, I just want to let you know I made it in Joburg. I made it home safely. <laughs> I made it home safely. And oh, shit. I thought you're in the next room or something or you booked something. I don't know. But anyway, if I did anything wrong, I'm sorry, my baby. Uh, you know me from, like, deep down, like, because I've, all I've been to you was tell the truth. Tell your woman the truth, you know. With other, any of my girls, I've lied about everything. Like, I never lied. I never lied. I, uh, I would say the truth. Even when you say a little lie, I'd go back to Kanye and say, baby, <laughs> that was a lie. But this is the truth, you know. Because there's so much freedom when you tell the truth. But you don't tell me I'm home safe and you say chat soon. They say deal with your problems privately, but... Um, Hey guys, me, I'm just a little guy. Like, this is deep for me. It's, it's like, fuck what you heard. It's like, at least tell me, baby. I'm, I'm, I'm flying out. <laughs> That's all. Like, you're my dog. You know, uh, you're my wife. You're my person. We, we did everything together for the past eight months. You know, everything. We wake up in the same house. Are you running errands for work? Are you doing, are you, like, out, guys. <sighs> this is the first woman I've, like, like, really loved. And, and to actually learn to tell the truth because many people in relationships don't say the truth. If I'm doing something bad, I'll tell Kanye, babe, this is what's happening right now. You know, these are the ups and downs. These are our exit plans. Um, are you in or are you out? And can you be like, go for it, baby. You know, she was my biggest cheerleader. Let's do it. Let's go. But then... And funny enough, one of my guys in Joba even told me that, yo, bro, Kanye left SA, I mean, left Dubai. You just don't know. And the person is one of my enemies. Imagine one of your enemies calling you, telling you your girl has left. Like, shit, have I been that bad to this woman? Like, that she even admits to, to my own people that I'm fighting battles with that she's... Ah, guys. And we speak about loyalty. <laughs> Hard chest pains. Deep, deep chest pains. You know, you know when, 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 when you hear that someone passed away, like your, your girlfriend dies or your boyfriend passed away, that's the feeling that I have right now. Like, Oh, yeah, when we were arguing um, with words or text phones, like, I hate you, I did this, this, that, you know, like, it's just exchanging words. Uh, you don't actually see that, oh, it would get that deep. Someone just like, boom. But imagine if it was me that have just left. You know, guys, my mom, my own mother has been saying, could... Get your passport, get your bags, go to America, you can stay in America. Leave this woman. And I made her listen to the voice and I said, babe, listen to what my mom is saying. Because you and I are honest with each other. We don't leave anything unaddressed like we...
And for me, when I was planning my things three, four months ago, just to get a peace of mind for me to work, I could have just ditched everyone in, in Joburg. Flew light. Just me as a single man. Disappear. Like, you know, you know, you know how you just ghost someone. You know how you just, like, disappear in someone's life. But I'm saying, baby, where we're going, we can be big. We just need to see how far we want to go, you know. This is what I can do. These are my strengths. These are my weaknesses. So I'm here in Dubai registering, not registering, registered a company for my, and, and my wife, my, my girlfriend who's back in Joburg is the major shareholder and she's the principal just for me to get our Emirates IDs and visas. And, and it's just like, baby, come to Dubai, like South Africa, there's just so much. Before we left Joburg, we spoke about it, I said, baby, sit down. Do you know when we go to Dubai, do you not know Kanye there? They don't know you. They do not know you. They don't know you. They don't know me either, you know. Are you gonna be happy with that? Is it that the, uh, fuck guys, me I'm hurting, I don't wanna lie, like, I don't wanna act like a, like a boss, like a man or whatever, like I'm, I'm something deep. Uh, I just saw, I just seen an opportunity for me and my girl that, damn, you, you, you don't make that much in Joburg. Uh, how about we try like a stronger currency? We spoke about how we, we planned our things, you know. We spoke about how we'd leave a daughter in a place, a uh, very nice place, fully furnished, serviced, all that stuff. Before we left Joburg, I was like, oh, don't worry, baby, I'll pay it, whatever it is, I'll sort it out. I never asked for a bill split with my girl. I was always a man, I take care of everything, you know. Bend bridges with many people. With a lot of people, I bend a lot of bridges just to make my girl happy. I didn't abuse her physically. I didn't I didn't do that. I didn't touch her or anything. I did not do that. And she can confirm, you know. The worst you've done is just to text on the phone because I realize if I start talking, it will seem like I'm shouting. So let me rather put everything on text. Let me put everything so she can't. And guys, can you do not leave because of, of money? Like me and her, we're okay. We're good. We can take care of ourselves normally, you know. Um, but I, I, I was the family man, you know, with, with the plan for my family that you can be big, you can be global. Like you can make shit happen, you know. You you, you can be a bigger Kanye Bao. Not just someone in Senton in the in the in Joburg and you're taking bookings and, and, and movies and all that stuff. Let's go big, baby, you know. It's a risk. And you and I we promise each other, baby, we can't fail no matter what. We can't fail. But me realizing you're in Joburg, like just now what do you what do you expect me to do guys this is a girl i say forever young with drunk even when we are drunk me and kanye always we never fought we we sing gospel songs you know i have videos that i can post right now that me and my girl, we are always happy you know like no matter what we go come to the club get we get home we start Oh shit, it's gonna be a Sunday. Let's sing about Jesus, you know? Because we, we are both from Christian families, you know? Can you complain that, dude, I have your name on the tattoo. What is it that you can do? My religion does not take, I'm not, I'm not allowed to put tattoos. But I did, you know, I also have a tattoo here that says Kanye Bao on my chest. I swear to my life, I would never put a tattoo. But baby, it is, you know, it's, this is how we treat each other now. Like I'm saying, I don't have a problem you being in Joburg. Like, 
I don't have a problem. But why? Why just not tell me? Why just not? I wouldn't fight you if you say, dude, I'm booking a ticket, I'm going back home. I wouldn't fight. I see Lassizgo is saying, stop this, please. Lassizgo, you don't know how much I've sacrificed for your sister. And I knew this two, I mean, like two months after I'd met her. I would have planned things differently, you know. But anyway, guys, uh, it is what it is. Mrs. K is in Joburg. She said me and her will talk soon, so I'll wait for us to talk soon. Um, I tried to be a man that's, that's responsible, a man who takes care of his family no matter what. Fuck me and my feelings. Why treat me like this, baby? Like, I'm, I'm struggling. I'm struggling to understand. Why treat me like this? Let's just say, I'm out. But I love you anyway. I know I'm happy you're home. Love continues. Um, let's see, I'm not enemies with your sister. I didn't fight Kanye in Dubai. I literally just brought my girl so we can we could be as as big as we wanted to be. We were in Joburg. She knows how I honestly live. So let me say what I have to say because I'm hurting. I mean you would hurt too if you realize shit your partner is is in is in is in London now. Uh, your your partner is in is in London now, and you're just in you're in South Africa. At least should have he, he should have said something. Just say, yo, do it. I'm traveling tomorrow. Same thing that I I'll do with Kanye. I'll just say, okay, baby, we are traveling somewhere. We are going together. Should we go? Should we not go? and all of that stuff. So don't think I'm here to embarrass your sister. I'm not here to embarrass Kanye. I love her, you know? I'm just here to say, but baby, why? Like, why are you putting me in shock like this? Like, I thought we were cool. Dang. But anyway, we'll see what's next, guys. Uh, we'll catch up later. But this definitely hurts. And a lot of guys out there, if you sacrifice your shit for your person, 